Hi. Let's play against the best backgammon robot in the world. It's called Extreme Gammon 2 and I will talk about it on the way. So we'll choose file, new, new match and we play a match. So, so this uh, Extreme Gammon 2, it plays really well. It plays like close to GTO, which is game theory optimal, the optimal way to play. Of course, it's not uh, playing 100% uh, optimal. Um, so here, uh, let's talk about the game. While I sip my coffee, um, we have like two points in the board, three points in the board actually, with the with the first six point and then the three and the one point. Then we have one on the bar and we have some threats here. So um, and we are ahead in the race. I think we can uh, cube him here, and he will take double take. So yeah, and uh, let's talk about uh, the performance rating here. That's uh, an expression for how well we played. If we play uh, zero point. Zero, 0 it means that we play a perfect backgammon uh, from a GTO standpoint and um, yeah this world champ is, will change to expert to yeah something usually I'm not uh, even close to this performance rating I'm by no means a good backgammon player I just enjoy to play the game let's see what we should do here I think we need to uh, keep up the aggression and hit him here and hopefully he won't come out on the fourth so we can build this point uh, afterwards so we should uh, our main focus sh should uh, should be to build this. However, we can uh, oh, sorry we can hit him here, and but then we only got one builder down here to build the uh, two points here, and we he's coming out here. That's not well. We want him to come out uh, like a bit deeper. So if we do like maybe this and this, then we um, might have we have a blood here, but we made the four point. Instead of the two point, I think that's better. And he's having two on the bar. What's the alternative? Well, the alternative would be something like, yeah, it's probably this. No, I don't like this. Let's see what the bot says. If this is a mistake, the bot will show up with a two to, oh shit, that was a blunder. That's a really bad, um, bad mistake. This one cast us like uh, 0 0.234, which is uh, a huge blunder. Usually you say that if it's uh, above 0 0.08, it's, uh, it's a big mistake. So this one was really not good. This actually, we played to three and this actually cost me 0 0.2 um, b b points in the game. So not well. But however, we do as the bot says, but we will see that performance rating is now affected we are now a beginner and um yeah it was not well so we'll hit him here and hopefully he's not, he's not coming out and we can build a point afterwards so here what do we want to do we can either move out here or we can move down to builders to uh, to make these points when he get out i think that's uh, important so we can win a gammon and win the game See, this, this builder helped us uh, build this point. And I think the five, we don't want to bury these two. Those ones we can move, so we'll just move down here. And our performance rating is slightly uh, getting better because we're moving this one here, one. And then I think we'll just move the two here. So we'll have the two extra builders to build the last point here. We don't want to split those here. And we need to fight for this point uh, to close him out. Uh, we'll, we won't uh, be getting this point. No, we'll be hitting him here. And we can see, what do we want to do? He has three on the bar. We want to give him a gammon. So do we want to build this point? Or we just want to uh, split over here to just... Uh, oh, sorry, not split. Do we want to build this point? We can't build it now, but we can leave this builder here and this one here. Or do we want to move up here? Oh, well, I'm not that good at backgammon. I think it's we need to hit here. Then we can uh, think about where to put our last two. We can either split here. Well, then we leave the blood. Then I think we could um, we could move up here, or we could uh, move up here. Well, this one doesn't change anything. That's out of the question. So it boils down to either securing this or split here. I think we'll split. And I was right.
we can go we can always go back to see what's right um, here it was actually right to go up here uh, to the h6 but it was a small mistake we see that our move is here and the right move was here so and this was a really small mistake i mean i'm okay with that so can we make this point no we should um, we should take down more builders so we'll make a four here then we have two builders we don't want to use the six over here because then we'll just duplicate the trees to close this one so we'll make the fours and then i think we'll just move this one yep now we close the board we are favorite to win the game and favorite to give him gammon which is our goal so we will win the game now we just need to clear though so we need to get rid of uh, this one we need to move it over here mm. so what are you thinking of here uh, yeah i think this one is, works well we will here let's say that i move this and he's obviously he can't do anything then we'll get a double six in the next row then we'll move one two and then we'll have we will be forced to make a blood here so this was not a good move what can we do else we can what can we do to not um, be giving any shots when we here we will move up here to here and then we'll make a blood as well if we if we will be dicing uh, double six so here one down two one two three four so the, the double six is, uh, is now a good roll for us what about now yep it still is and again i'm no expert i just like to play against robots and, um, played a lot of against uh, poker robots as well so now you can see oh that was not a, not well it says that we actually want to move up here Yeah, okay well we do as the bot uh, says so this one was our move and we can see that this uh, is an error so let's just oh sorry let's what's happening now um we'll we'll be moving up the bot should just, i think that we are we, we should just secure our checkers in the most secure way because we will win the gammon and that's double the points like in almost every game so now it's lagging here so basically we just want to get these ones out before he gets one check out then one game because we want we play for two points and uh, play for game we can see that our performance rating uh, with our uh, initial blunder is um, decreasing from like 20 or something hard i think what i what i'm usually playing is between like six and ten i'm not that good so i resign a backgammon now our, our opponent the robot will resign i accept, accept. <laughs> with the bot um, suggestions and move with that we played like close to world champion but however we made a couple of mistakes and uh, we made two errors and one blunder so we played a performance rating with 6.94 which is an expert we could uh, we could review the match um, we could uh, choose the settings we will only want to see our, the bottom play hours and we want to see uh, all the mistakes let's uh, hold on We'll just move to the beginning then we could uh, maybe learn something here yeah that was a big big mistake we should just make this point instead of um, making this point and making a blood here that was a big mistake that's something to learn from really um here oh, that's not really sure about the intuition here if you got the intuition you can leave the a comment in the in this comment section because i'm not really sure why we want to move up here but it might be more safe uh, when we want to clear the and there's no more errors 
So uh, yeah, that was playing against the best backgammon robot in the world called Extreme Gammon 2.